So this is the current state of my desk. Which is why I am filming on my bed. Hi guys, so long time no talk. Um, mostly because before break um, I was super busy with tests and assignments and then break started and I got like super sick. Still kind of am. <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. Um, and um, I've just been trying to enjoy myself, I guess. So since I'm on break and I'm not really like going to uni or anything, I thought I would just talk about something from back in first year, which was um, my medical school interview. And I'm sure a lot of like high school students, you're probably curious about it because I know that it is one of the main differing factors between medical entry and the two medical schools in New Zealand, so like Otago doesn't have an interview for um, um, undergraduate entry I believe, whereas Auckland does, so yeah, that would be cool to talk about it. I used to blog in first year as well, but I think my last blog would have been like around uh, exam season, and the interviews are actually like at a really weird time in the year, like they were placed a few weeks after the last Biomed exam. Um, if you lived in halls like I did, you'd have to like, you'd be kicked out of the halls by then, like it's move out day and you'd have to go home and then about three or four weeks later you'd have your interview. Even though the three weeks after exams timing is a bit weird for an interview um, because like you feel like oh yay I've like finished uni but then also like oh I still have one more thing left before I'm like officially free. Then again those three to four weeks before between exams and your interview is kind of nice because you have time to just forget about like just throw all that like cramming that you've done before exams out of your brain and just think about why you want to do medicine or pharmacy or optometry so you might not already know but there's only one interview for pharmacy medicine and optometry in that like you could apply for all three programs but you only have to do the interview once because I guess they're all health professions and they're all kind of assessing the same qualities that they want in a health professional so they just made one interview also it's a multiple mini interview or MMI which you might have heard it referred to as um, which means that you don't have like it's so the interviews like set around an hour long it's not an hour long with like one person grilling you thank god so you have eight stations and basically how the stations work is that they're eight minutes long but you get two minutes to read the question or scenario um, by yourself because they're on a chair outside the station and then you read that question for two minutes and then you hear, you'll hear a bell and then you go into the room and sit down and talk about the question with the interviewer for six minutes so um yeah six minutes plus the two minutes of reading the question time on your own eight minutes per station Hopefully that made sense. Yeah, so for that two minutes, it's really good because you know, you're just by yourself, you can just break apart the question, think about what you wanna say, and you won't be flustered, and you're not being asked questions on the spot. And most of the stations are just typical, like they'll ask you like about an experience in your life that you could think about, that um, you may have learned particular skills or qualities from. Some of the questions are kind of like job interview style questions, I would say, like, talking about like your um, best qualities and your worst qualities and then one particular station that stands out from the rest of them is definitely the acting station so rather than having you and one interviewer and just chatting about a particular question um, this one is you go into the room and you straight away have to start um, acting out the scenario that you were given and reading for the first two minutes with a professional actor so they know what they're doing where and the interviewer is like sitting in a corner and watching you and the actor talk and interact. 